How Billionaire Inventor James Dyson Saved $500 Million in Two Years from Singapore's Low Tax Regime James Dyson is one of the UK's most successful entrepreneurs. He has a multi-billion dollar fortune made from his ownership of Dyson, manufacturers of vacuums and other household products. Dyson moved to Singapore in 2019. He moved himself and his business headquarters to Singapore. He stated publicly that he wanted to be closer to the rapidly growing Asian markets. But, there may have been other factors in Dyson's thinking in his move to Singapore. No tax on dividends. Singapore is not a traditional zero tax haven. If you work and earn in Singapore you'll pay tax there. However, Singapore is a territorial tax country. Most types of income earned outside Singapore will be tax-free. Dyson's company has paid out some of the biggest dividends in British corporate history. The largest of those dividends were paid out after his move to Singapore. In 2020 his Singapore-based holding company Weybridge was paid a dividend of £400 million, $460 million. In 2021 a dividend of £1 billion, $1.15 billion, was paid to Dyson's family holding company. These dividends would have been tax-free in Singapore. The dividends Dyson received in Singapore would have been taxed at 39.35% had he stayed in the UK. His move to Singapore saved him over $500 million in only two years. Singapore has no inheritance tax. Dyson has a fortune of $12.3 billion, according to Bloomberg. For such massive wealth, estate planning is important. Singapore abolished all inheritance taxes in 2008. Therefore, his wealth can be easily transferred to the next generation. There are many places with lower corporate taxes than Singapore's 17%. This was likely not a huge consideration for Dyson. The main source of income for his Singapore holding company is likely to be dividends from overseas companies. Singapore also has many other exemptions and deductions for research and development and tech companies. James Dyson is exactly the kind of entrepreneur that the Singapore authorities want to attract. He is operating businesses, he's super rich and successful and he'll be viewed as a welcome addition to the community. A second passport in Singapore can be possible in as little as two years. It would be unusual for most people to obtain Singapore citizenship so quickly. But for someone like Dyson it's likely to be waved through rapidly. Easier access to explosive growth markets in Asia. When Dyson made his move to Singapore the reason he gave publicly was that he wanted to be closer to the booming Asian marketplace to develop his business. A base in Asia brings you closer to supply chains and potential new markets in Asia. Singapore has much less crime than the UK. The crime index for Singapore is a low 27. Compared to 47 in the UK, Singapore is considered one of the safest cities in the world. As countries like the UK and US become less safe every year, well-run Asian countries like Singapore become more attractive. Avoid future exchange controls and global tax. Dyson may have seen the writing on the wall for the UK. The size of the state has grown significantly in the last 20 years and is now out of control. The state already spends around 50% of GDP. The only way the UK government will be able to survive is by taxing the rich they're likely to introduce a wealth tax in the near future. It's also likely that some kind of exchange controls will be introduced to stop people ditching the pound. They may even try to implement citizenship-based taxation like the US to discourage high net worth taxpayers from escaping. Anyone, even with moderate wealth, can follow the same strategies as Dyson. It doesn't have to be Singapore either. There are many low tax options globally. As things become more difficult for Western governments they'll make it more difficult for you and your money to escape. Liberty Mundo help high net worth clients protect their wealth and diversify their citizenships. If you need help with protecting your wealth, reducing your taxes, or relocating overseas, use the link in the description to get in touch.